in terms of Savio, in terms of uh, promoting beekeeping, who's doing what in Goa? Apart from Icar, who are having classes yes. and giving the even Khadi and Village Industries, they are promoting. I see. Okay, and there are some other actually, agriculture department. Agriculture also is promoting because uh, it is uh, coming from the center. The schemes. I see. From the National Bee Board. Where is the National Bee Board in Delhi? So National Bee Board is in Delhi, so they are promoting everywhere and certain funds is allocated. Even for the panchayats, uh, now uh, there is a notification come I see. For, um, for each panchayat, I think so they have allocated some funds. I don't know exactly whether it is 5 lakhs or less than that. So you spent uh, many years in this. What was your journey like? Was it difficult at the start? Yes, very much. Did difficult? people yes. think you were foolish or what? People used to think like what this fellow is doing, you know. So I realized because we want more fruit to be there in our villages and natural way. Yeah. We don't require polyler sprays to be sprayed on our trees. Because now what they do is for the mango trees, you'll see most of them the trees are sprayed. Which can be done naturally by this honeybees. Mm. So if we have this colony, you'll get a bumper yield. Even my friends, like uh, last time, uh, he's holding colonies in Aldona. I see. So, this year he has got a bumper yield in Tamarin. In wow. the month of June. Really? Even the branches has collapsed. So, it's to such an extent. I see. Yes. And how did you start? Where did you first come across the idea? Actually, I used to, I wanted to, when I went to Dubai, I saw whatever, yeah. certain things, you yeah. know, when I had, uh, I was working in Dubai. What field? In accounts. Actually, okay. I'm a graduate. I see. Commerce? Commerce. Like me. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay. So, what happened is, I saw, like, you know, they are doing a lot of things, which, uh, like, you know, they have to import everything from the other countries, because it's a desert. And we have everything here. In Goa, we have the land, Correct. we have the trees, but we do nothing. Correct. So why not like, you know, start something where we can like, you know, increase the yield of the uh, area. Because they, when, when there is good flowering, when the trees are yielding, you also feel good. Of People course. get very good fruit. So you don't have to depend on the other states. So you came back and you started? I started actually, I started uh, when I had come here on vacation. I see. Because I got this one colony. In, From? As I said, like, you know, it was in the, uh, what we cover, in the plastic. Yeah. You know, we, it was. Ah, you got folded. it in your home itself. Yes, yes. So, th that's what. So, from that, I multiplied. I kept on multiplying. I learned how to multiply on the net. Which breed this was? This is a stingless. No, when you, on your net. When you got it first? This is a stingless. 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 Yes. This is a stingless. stingless. Lucky, it, yeah. it is called Trigona honeybees. Because earlier, no, each and every house, they had somewhere or the other place. Because mostly the houses were of mud. Correct. Okay. And they used to stay in the mud houses. Yeah. They had the colonies. Oh. So what happens is now you hardly find the mud houses. And the honey is medicinal of this bees. And people are searching out for or looking out. Wow. Because since it is medicinal, it has a lot of medicinal values. Even a few days back, someone called me like, you know, they are using it for some, uh, this, uh, what do you say? Uh, Healing? No, no. Massage or no? No, no, not massage. When your kid kidneys don't function. Yeah, kidney failure. Stones? Not stones. Kidney failure. I'm not getting the... Dialysis? Dialysis. You know, they require... I said, why? Who recommended all this? I things? see. I asked them. Like, you know, for dialysis, I don't know for what they are using it. Because uh, either I see. the wound might be to okay. heal the wound. Okay. Even this honey can be used on wounds. I for see. healing. So, it has a lot of uh, medicinal value. Savio, one frightening thing is when, a, when the bees come and make a colony in your home. Yes. Then how do you deal with that? See, you have to first find out what type of bees they are. 
like there are different breeds like the rock bees which are uh, aggressive which uh, make hives for the churches okay. the high uh, like you know buildings okay. and all and then there is another breed called apis serena which okay. you can rear there is another which uh, is called apis floria so what happens is you should understand which uh, breed it is okay. if you can understand that then you can easily take care of it because mostly what they do is like you know whenever they are disturbed or swimming time they come and this uh, make a temporary halt at the location i see they might not be permanent and they might move after 2 days 3 days and okay. if they find it's, it's uh, like you know safe for them then they start building the combs okay so that's how it is like and know. sometimes they don't even build the combs they just hang on to each other and looks yes, like a hive ye- yes Th- that is the temporary halt okay because uh, this rock bees are migratory they'll keep uh, they'll keep on moving okay if they find a place then they'll make a hive then they'll leave then they'll go i see whereas apis serena apis serena is like you know uh, you can rear them what i mean to say is you can yeah. put them in the boxes as how i have put i can, i will show you that also yeah yeah we'll go we'll uh, go yes. and see so people who have fear of all this uh, yeah. bees they can go for stingless they are called trigona Very and this is done on a large scale in kerala this uh, uh, there are many like you know I who see. are rearing yes really? yes and on the internet also you'll get honey mostly from kerala okay. or somewhere or uh, other places very interesting so we should also in goa because we have the they are they, they can be reared in goa also so why not uh, go in for all this thing? some contact number for you you'll just mention yes 97648942124212 yes thanks